is the Waffle Bros. I'm Corwin. And I'm Uko. And we are back with more Half-Life 2. Picking up where we left off on Route 69 or whatever it is. Route 17. I don't know. The important thing is that this doesn't really look like a proper route. And more like something that people used to go along to sell moonshine or something like that. Doesn't or, it? Or like artisan meth. This is my artisan meth. Uh, I guess it's all artisan small batch meth. Yeah, unless you're Walter White, then, you industrial know. Industrial like evil Industrial meth. meth and magic. That's <laughs> that's what it is. Oh, oh somebody, Yo, somebody don't um, want to get run over? Well, you're going to get run over anyway, bitch. Speaking of meth, this is probably why I thought about meth and, and journeys. Apparently, I guess it was during the Winter War, there was a Finnish motherfucker. I just... Saw the headline. I need to read this article in depth, yo. <laughs> Apparently, at some point, this this Finnish soldier got cut off in the depths of Finland somewhere from all his other people, or, or, or they all got killed or whatever. And he had no supplies, no food, no nothing, but he had, like, enough meth for 30 dudes. So he just <laughs> took... Somehow, all of the mess. Somehow, all of it, which is and, insane. And was like, did not I'm gonna fuck you, uh, Soviet motherfuckers up. Uh, I don't think he did much fighting of against people, but he did kill and eat a bird raw. Um, yeah, and also, cool? <laughs> I think maybe he lost some toes and uh, didn't care. It was crazy. <laughs> I mean, I, I, I can dig it. I can dig it. Um, this motherfucker, this fucking guy um well, no, finish people don't mess around no they can i can i like knock this over by pulling stuff toward here i bet you can give it a little hip swivel yep i mean i know i could just do it with the crane but but, but you do fine it. we'll just do it with the Aww. crane whatever that would that would have been uh ain't nobody got time uh, for that that That's would have been swagalicious say. swagalicious Swagalicious. Swagtacular. Swagtacular. Um, okay, let me just uh, move that sensualized shadow over there. I wonder who and, was the uh, first uh, uh, person. Uh, 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 get get down. Get, get down, get funky. Get down, dude, get Fred, dude, get funky. Oh, dude, it's come one on, of those invisible. It's one of those cables that doesn't cast a shadow. <laughs> well, earlier you, I saw the shadow of my car floating, so. You can't get that. You can't get any of this stuff at Lowe's. No. Our, our Home Depot. No, you can't. Um, come our on. Our Harbor Freight. Come on. Snatch it up. Snatch it like you mean it. There we go. Okay. It's That doesn't, leave, that doesn't seem safe. Yeah, none of this seems OSHA approved. Although that also, ocean is probably ocean approved. There we go. Oh, they're coming to kill me. They're coming to kill me. Splat, Whatever splat, will splat, I do. Splatter them. Uh, I don't need to splatter. I don't even know if you can splatter them. But what I can do is uh, fail to explodinate them. That's what I can do. There we go. That's the explosions that we all know and love. Is I, that guy trying to creep over there? Oh. It's got to be just, just rank moralization that keeps people from being issued just a little bit of meth <laughs> in the <laughs> army now. Right. Yeah. Because they definitely all across all the people except maybe the US in World War Two, they tested that it was safe enough. <laughs> it was safer um, than getting uh, shot. Am I stuck on stuff? I'm stuck on stuff. No, no. We can't we can't okay, I'll just I'll just get out and um and there we go. Gravitize. I I have the necessary gravitas, gravitas to gravitize and they can uh, gravitate toward these nuts. But yeah, you, but you oh. know that there's plenty of soldiers right now who are like, can't they just give us a little bit of meth? I mean, I'm pretty sure that probably people find a way to get coked up in the army today. You know? Yeah, I'm sure. Coked up, methed up. And every time you say methed up, it sounds like you're saying I'm messed lisping. up with a speech impediment. <laughs> yes. Doesn't it? It I guess Doesn't it? Well, speech is a methy process. Yeah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes it is. Uh, 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 don't stand hey, hey, near you know exploding these guys. barrels when you're in combat. You know the com the combine probably get meth piped directly into the suit. Oh um, no, no, teleported directly into their fucking uh their their body. Dude, dude. That's what it is. It teleports get, straight into your brains, or maybe it just like teleports straight into your neurotransmitters. <laughs> That's what it does. Yeah. Um, 
don't 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 give anybody that idea okay because, oh, well, neurotransmitter like on the one hand it'll cause big pharma to invent uh teleportation faster look man big look here's the thing Big Pharma will invent wireheading, okay? They'll, they'll find a <laughs> yeah, way. You know, it'll be much easier to just, like, have an implant that tickles your happy bone oh, yeah. than to, and uh... Then it, it, it'll, it'll just be Netflix. It'll just... What'll happen is you plug the thing into your brain... I kind of wanted to ram that motherfucker, you know? It would have been cool. It, it would have been awesome. Would have been cool if I... If I'd rammed them, probably what would have happened is I would have just died. So, <laughs> yeah. Uh, can I even kill it like this? I mean, let's try it. I'm assuming I can. Let me try to position this so the pole will block him from hitting me up the hole. This is this is taking a lot of time. Yeah. Pretty uh, sure up there there's going to be like rocket launchers at some yeah, point. Yeah, and it looked like it wasn't so, doing damage. Yeah, it didn't it didn't feel like okay, there we go. I think this is like the area I'm supposed to fight it in and uh got to hit him with the old Ripka. You know. Oh, straight to his like old, rotor ass. Ripka. Oh, I'll uh, motorboat it all night. Um, it's Yo, still alive, bro. I it's still, still. I've been having. Alive. I've been having that urge uh, ever since we made the previous video. To play, uh, to play Jerry's mod. mod. Yeah, <laughs> just Jerry's mod. That's what it's called. And it's you can't ben do and Jerry's to stop mod. It. I bet. I bet the community for that mod has turned it into full insanity by now i, I bet got a I nice bet, amount of health i bet it's like i bet there's vr mods and crazy wild shit i mean i, I would have thought that by now though that vr chat would have greatly taken over oh because, shit you're right like yeah. vr chat doesn't have any um any standards <laughs> let's put it like that they're just like you want to you know pissing anime girls you go right at it <laughs> Yes, We've pissing made, anime girls. Someone's made a mini game where anime girls fly through the air on the power of their own farts? piss. Piss streams, farts, farts and piss, whatever. Yeah, they, yeah, piss they'll, farts. They'll let you do it. Uh, don't don't piss and fart at the same time. That's how you die. You know. Uh, no, I've done it. <laughs> you gotta understand. I, I I'm a filthy person. I haven't pissed and farted at the same time. I I don't think. I'm not very flatulent. Okay. It's what what it is. It's it's in the morning. You're, you 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 got to take a wicked leak. The the leak is in progress. And what are you gonna fart later? Because you're fancy. Uh, these like... balls are starting to weigh me down, bro. The ball. Oh shit. Um. Yeah. Those balls are fucking it up. Um. Dude. Um, dude. Stop. Stop doing that shit to my car. It's not cool. It's like it was. No, it was giving you free. Um. A free. Like, Sex electricity. No. No. Free swag suspension. Um, sure. Free like swag those, suspension. Like those motherfuckers in the uh, in the GTA. I know what you're talking about. I I get your vibe. I bet there's still motherfuckers around here though. I just I just knows it. There we go. Get did rid they, of you. Did they tr like teleport them into these buildings to squat in here till Gordon comes along? <laughs> and remember, if they teleport them, they have to go to Zen first. Oh yeah, you don't you don't want that. Okay. okay, so now, okay, that's a question. I know you don't really see them teleporting that much, but their big thing that they want out of, you know, Breen and everybody is local planet to part of the same universe. Teleportation. Teleportation. They, they yeah. can only transport between dimensions. What if they just teleport to Zen first and then go, go wherever they want? Yeah, I agree. Because they can, they can go to Earth whenever they choose. Yup. Oh, dude, I'm giving them the business. Maybe, maybe their teleporters can only work like a Stargate. Where they or maybe have it's like, like a... massively energy intensive or something like that. I don't know. I... Oh, oh, or it turns you into those like worm dudes. <laughs> yeah, they, uh, they start out looking like anime elves, but by the time they go through so the teleporter... So you're saying the people of the Combine used to be super beautiful? Yeah, they, they start out looking like anime elves. And then they go through the teleporter, and it becomes that disaster they look like. You know, that kind of makes sense now that you've, like, said it with your brain with my, face. Yeah, with my flappy mouth. Look at all them bullets. How come before it was giving me this ammo, and now it's only giving me shit ammo? Whatever. Whatever. I mean, then again, anytime you eat, like, a hamburger, it's giving you shit ammo. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I fucking said it. I refuse to, to hear that. Oh, 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 you don't... 
you don't agree with me speaking my truth words, that's no, that's not what you're about. Because anytime you eat anything, it's giving you shit ammo. You're not wrong, and I. It's and you know what? I accept it. Increasing your ability to. I can't unleash another turd bomb. I can't like low key brag about piss farting, and then act like there's a limit to to what I'll yeah, accept. Yeah, yeah. You you don't get to live, buddy. You don't get to live. Um. Apparently, he thought he got to live, though, because he was taking a licking and keeping on dicking. I had to say it. No, I'm, I had to I'm say pretty it. sure that when you join up to oh, be they a snip combine, your cock off. They snip your cock off. And, I, see, um, I think oh, they hold it. No, they it, snip uh, your cock off, and they dry it out, and then, like, that horror beast um, smokes it. No, see, I think they hold it hostage. They put it in a jar with a label on it with your number, right? I think it's you, like the thing with the human horn in Futurama. Well, no, That's no what I, think I think what it is is that if you if you're a good little comboin, comboin, <laughs> combine boy, if you're a good little comboin, yeah, if if you never you know mutiny or whatever, and you do your service, then you know you get your dick back. They sew it back on. Um. Yeah, that's that, that's, that's why exactly that's why they works. That's why they're willing to fight the Freeman. It's like, hey, go out there and fight him. And they're like, I don't want to. And they're like, well, you want me to flush your dick? Fist the Freeman. <laughs> Um, that almost just, like, immediately rejaculated at me. And I returned to sender that shit. I Yo, returned okay, maybe, to sender that shit. Maybe Eli could figure out a way to give them new dicks. Um. But, oh, but it'll just be... Oh, able to that's what you... By, by anti-reproduction field, what they meant oh, was they, they, come the just they just come chop off all your dicks. <laughs> well, he re he probably replaced his with like a smaller leaf spring right next to his other leg. Is somebody still shooting me? It feels like somebody's still shooting me, or maybe those things were just shockinating were, me. Oh, oh, this is what I got to do. Yeah, be gone, motherfucker. Be gone. There. Um, I think it exploded into a thousand salty car pieces after I did that shit. There we go. I still want to drive one of their, like, Combine Weird Boy tanks. I mean, don't you? I was just about to say that, in fact, because, you know, they're cool. They're evil, but they're still cool. Also, they got this very, like, I don't know, it reminds me slightly of the way cars and stuff looked in the Grim Fandango. Yeah. You get my vibe yeah, with that. A little bit um, 1930s-ish. I'm going to be real. I, I kind of want to replay the Grim Fandango at some point, but I'm also afraid of, like, getting stuck repeatedly and hating, like, certain parts of the game. I, I You know, well, I, I, I you loved know the Grim Fandango when I was a child. It's kind of why... It's kind of why we petered out doing the Mist playthrough. Yeah. Because doing that shit... Maybe we could stream it or something. I can see that. But, um, like, doing it in video form is hard. Where, where, where did it go? There was like a fucking. Was there a hell? There copter? was a smellcopter, and now <laughs> it just fucked off. Well, well it knows what's I'm good. I, we'll we'll rocket it later. That's what we'll oh, do. Oh, it's the bridge. Yup. The suspension or the non-suspension bridge. bridge to fear. A bridge to fear. That's what it is. It's not a bridge I too like far. It. But it's a it is a bridge to fear. Um, come on, come out of the come out of the sex cabin. It's all good. I'm remember, just, uh, remember, gonna no, purge no you. dicks. It's not. It can't be a sex cabin. Yeah, they're just bumping nubs together. Maybe they just like slam their Ken and Barbie, you know, spots that, together. That's what yeah. I meant. That's what I meant by bumping nubs. <laughs> bumping nubs. <laughs> <laughs> it reminds yeah. me. It reminds me of that thing. That dude that had the bifurcated penis that made you not recognize that he was castrated. Yeah, we, we haven't talked about this in a while, so I will. I will look. I, I, I don't hasten. post the photo. <laughs> that will get our channel yeah, destroyed. That, no, we, I'm not doing that. I, ha I, ha I hasten to add that I didn't see this live live in the flesh world, but someone did post it on an image board, and this guy had a surgically bifurcated dong. I mean, for a second there, you almost had people thinking that you were cool enough. Yeah, to hang out with people with to hang with, out with people with um, double dicks. Yeah, I'm not. No, I'm not, no, I'm not that cool. No, I do not approve of you. And hey, you here, bullshit. here's how cool I was <laughs> in my youth. In my youth, I knew the people who would go to that one theater where they would show the Rocky Horror Picture Show a lot. 
and they were like, hey, you should go on down and we'll do this. And, you know, you can go to one of these Rocky Horror Picture Show screenings. But in order to, this is, this is how I wasn't cool, I guess. They said that in order to make it into their secret, you know, you know, cult film watching party, you had to stand up in front of everybody in the theater and fake an orgasm. Um. Okay, I, and I I'm gonna hit you with this. What I'd have done is, you know, hidden some mayonnaise somehow on my crotch. Oh, and just super and sucker that just, shit out of there. With yeah, the, with just the steely eyes of of, of yeah. no emotion. And then just be like, do that do. thing where you point at yeah. your eyes and then point at them, and like I'm watching you. And then point at your crotch and then point at them. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's how I do it. I no emotion, motherfucker. Although I'll be honest, um, I oh shit. I might rather do as Gordon Freeman just did than watch the Rocky Horror Picture Show. Yeah, that, that was my argument. I, 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 don't, I don't care if we lose people on that. I, like, I think it's, it's the a, thing. It's fine if y'all want to watch it. It's just a boring movie to me. I, I don't like it. I mean, I, I'm saying it's a boring movie with the incredible. Okay, to be fair, uh, 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 with the incredible knowledge that I'm saying it despite having never seen it. <laughs> I've seen. Okay. I've seen like the four by three crap VHS version that I think it was the TV edit too so I guess there's profanity and shit that they removed if somehow there are kids out there watching this channel I'm gonna hit you with it right the most adult thing you can do is to judge something entertainment judge entertainment that you haven't that seen, you haven't seen. <laughs> yeah that's it's not a good, that's how you know you're yeah, an adult yeah, it's not a good thing to do but it is yeah, almost yeah. yeah it is almost by definition an adult thing to do you're you're not wrong. Yeah. God damn. So, that's uh, fucked up. Yeah. So just like, don't even watch, like, no, actually don't do this. I was going to say, don't even watch the rest of this video. Just <laughs> shut it off and thumbs down. <laughs> Fuck us. <laughs> that's how you're cool. <laughs> nah, nah, nah. Cool people watch this channel. I mean, that's, just, okay. That's just the be, only way to be cool. Just to be clear, don't you know? last, last time I checked, uh, a thumbs down is, is worth at least as much. As a thumbs up. Yeah. If, yeah, so if, yeah. You, if you really want to not help anyone... Don't thumbs down our videos. That'll yeah. make me... Uh, yeah, don't, don't do it just in case. Irritated. It could be <laughs> it could be total poison now, so please don't. <laughs> don't encourage people to thumbs down our videos. I'll cut your face. Okay. Thumbs up and hit the bell with your dong. Yeah, yeah. Or you don't have to hit it with your dong. With your labia, you know... Or whatever the fuck else. You can pinch to be zoom. a nerd and use your fingers like everybody else. Pinch to zoom. <laughs> Hi -yo. Whoa. Yo. Pinch to ejaculate. I don't. Also, okay, recently we learned of something horrifying yeah. that some okay, people okay. do, right? You saw this, the, the popping thing? Yeah, the popping. Okay, I, I will take this oh, while, God. Cor while Corwin shoots ah! Combine. <laughs> I saw on Reddit, and I had to read this out to Corwin to make sure I wasn't losing my mind. But some woman on Reddit asked it. First, she asked on Reddit's Ask Men forum, and it got deleted. And then she went on No Stupid Questions. <laughs> and she said that she had a boyfriend, I think it was an ex, amazingly, based on what you're about to hear, who, before he could arrive... He would have to pop his dick, and and I was like, "What?" What? Every, what? Everyone was like, "What?" And yeah. she proceeded to explain in in the, the in the thread that what would happen is he would get close, and then he would pull out, and then put his, I guess, sort of CPR chest compression wise, or to grab it and whatever. But he'd push in towards his midsection apply pressure in toward longitudinally toward the dick and hand would, on apply directly to the yeah dick it would make an audible popping clicking knuckle cracking sound and then the then the 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 floodgates would open and the thing is of course my response to that is like that can't be good for your penis no, that's the only thing it's not in fact it's like it's one of those things where i feel vaguely like it's dangerous to spread the knowledge. Honestly, of yeah, this, um, I regret everything. But, technique, but, I yeah, guess. Since we have said it, I'm not going to describe anymore how how it might be done. Just that if if it is, if you did, just it, don't do it. 
Yeah, it Because apparently, it can shockingly, apparently that's not good for your dick. Yeah, it can damage the erectile tissue, and you won't be able to get a boner even with the aid of pharmaceuticals. <laughs> Holy oh, shit. Yeah, yeah. I, Once you pop, apparently you can't you stop. You can't it's, stop. It's, it's addictive. Until you p stop forever. Yeah, Until you stop forever. So that's, uh... Yeah. Oh, dude, dude. That's I, not cool. I, I can't even imagine doing that, bro. Yeah. <laughs> I can't even... Dude, well, you know, the thing is, remember... See, the thing is, I can imagine doing... some. I can imagine somebody doing that to me to cause damage to my body. Yeah. Uh, do you know what I think it would be like, despite not, you know not gonna find out go ever. on you know that game trouble which oh, it's, it's, yeah i know it's, with the little bubble yeah, that you gotta pop yeah exactly it's aptly named yeah you, you, yeah one <laughs> it's the pop bubble with the dice in it <laughs> yup double trouble oh. your, double bubble your dick's in trouble you realize that our trouble was the travel size we never had a full size one you remember that yes i and remember that that's like, uh, that's how you know you are, like, that's how you know you're firmly in the middle class. Like, like we have one trap, we're not, that's twelve ninety nine, man. We're not getting another trouble game. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I remember when we were kids, we had like a travel chess game. This is, this is something that people who are younger than us probably just like, it doesn't make sense to. Uh huh. The pieces because, were so tiny. It was um, unbelievable. We were okay. Uko was old enough to have traveled before, like any kind of handheld games, or at least before a Game Boy, I should say. Remember the Travel Scrabble with like the magnetic, and it's they like, weren't even magnetic. Yeah. They were held on by like, I guess the Faith. way the way yeah <laughs> it, yeah the the way plastic sticks but to other plastic. It's like so. The thing is, I and and our family didn't have the money. For me to be graced with a Game Boy. So, uh... Yeah, so the handheld was uh, very primitive objects. Yeah, exactly. The, the handheld road trip situation were things that people could have invented in, like, the it's, year it's 10. Down, it's to that, it goes to that common denominator of the thing where you're looking out the window, imagining a little ninja running along on the side, uh, avoiding obstacles. Did you, <laughs> did you not do that? No, no, okay. no, Appar I didn't. Apparently, you're the only North American uh, in and European, and also just I'm just naming all the places with cars. <laughs> like, yeah, you got to go to Antarctica. Uh, I, I assume that in places where there's trains, it's beside a train. Uh, speaking of trains, we're gonna have to avoid a train here because yeah. that's totally gonna uh, happen. Apparently, everyone except you. Occasionally had like a weird daydream in the car, our train. Um, where uh, do I have to like boost really quickly to avoid head on apply directly? Um, you were clearly I'm sorry, a, you were alive, bitch. Oh, I guess the car got exploded. Oh, okay, whatever is what it is. That's some old bullshit. Um, I don't even know what was going on there because I didn't hop out of you and yet you hopped. But I think that it's possible now. It's probably been done, but I think you could use, uh, like, um... I, I genuinely don't understand what's going on. I guess I just got to turn around and wait for it. Yeah, like a normal it didn't, person. Yeah, like, like a chud. <laughs> okay, <laughs> like yeah. a chud. But uh, I think you could probably point a, a tablet or phone out the window and have the, car, have the uh, like, an app use the data, you know, to actually have that as a game where there's a little dude running... And jumping over stuff and it knows when there's you know stuff that it'll hit but anyway i remember playing travel chess against uko that was yep. the thing and i mean this that was, i did yeah it was like mag little magnetic pieces and they were so tiny that it was unbelievable it, like you wanted tweezers to play yep. chess um oh god it, oh it, lord I'm gonna get oh, oh you got the full austin powers thing <laughs> oh oh shit oh shit don't don't destroy my car there. If, it, if it fucking hits me again, honk, honk. I'm going to lose my shit. I probably could have just much more safely backed up. Yo, I got a question. Did the aliens, did they, that looks like an alien train, right? Yeah. I think it's weird that they made their own train. What I think is weird is that alien trains use the same, like, same gauge, gauge of, uh, I was, yeah, yeah. That, that's where I was going with that. It's fucking weird. I guess they, or they set up a whole train industry. <laughs> like, did they break every train on Earth during the, the like, four-hour war or whatever? 
Also, that it doesn't seem as if, like, putting people on meat hooks to transport them, like we find out later on they're doing, is the most efficient way. I don't think they're going for efficiency. I think they're going for evil. Yeah, I know, but I mean, like, efficiency is evil, right? Or did I... Did I misunderstand? <laughs> did <Not> I misunderstand? <laughs> Not all efficiency is evil. Look at the efficiency of the, the American cheese industry. Okay, I should have said evil likes to be efficient. How about that? That's true. Sometimes, How about that? Sometimes. Sometimes. Also, I, I assume the American cheese industry is efficient. <laughs> Because all the cheese is the same freaking color. Don't look. Don't don't start a war with Wisconsin. We can't. We can't deal with that. <laughs> they'll they'll um. Yo, their cheese. They'll is, beat us with our che with their cheese wheels. Their cheese is good, yo. Yeah, I know. But they'll beat us with their cheese hey, wheels. That's I regret that I will most likely see the apocalypse before I try cheese curds. <laughs> they sound good. to I me. I mean, you could always just get some cheese curds. You're I, the guy who was all like, I remember when I was a baby and I ate that uh. <laughs> Whatever the fuck, uh, the Smucker's uh, oh, peanut yeah. butter. Yeah, I'm going to eat that jam later. and I'll, I'll review that shit <laughs> in our next video. <laughs> yes. Anyway, we're going to stop here. If you enjoyed this video, please hit that schmexy thumbs up button. Make sure you ring the bell to keep getting notified of delicious waffle content. Waffle Bros signing out.